Hey guys and welcome to Mia's Mata or is it Maya's Mata? I'm gonna say Mia's Mata. I don't know. Either way, um, this game looks really interesting. Um, I don't really know that much about it. I just seen the trailer and noted the game was out today, uh, and it's obviously an indie game. Uh, I think it got uh, green lighted on Steam, or green light, or whatever you want to say. So let's just dive into it. In a different place and time. Do I have to click? I'm not sure. No. Your name is Robert Hughes. All right. My name is Robert Hughes. You awake on the shores of a mysterious island. You have come to this island an exiled man, a traitor and betrayed. Ooh. You are suffering from a plague, a disease which you will soon die. From which you soon will die. This island is home to a research outpost, a conclave of enlightened men searching for a cure. Discover the cure and survive. Okay. I guess that is our instructions then. <laughs> okay, Dafta. Okay, here we go. Oh god, why is it inverted? Um, no, 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 do not invert, how dare you? <laughs> okay, here we go. Can we go into the water? Can't see our legs. Oh, we can, we can swim. Okay, so we're swimming. We can run. This tab to open your journal. Okay. Your journal provides you with health status, medicine inventory and objectives. It also in includes all of your notes you collect and research. Oh god, and research you perform. Collect and research you perform on the island. Click on the tabs at the top of the journal to explore its various selections. Use A and D to navigate the journal page by page. Use R and B to zoom in. Press H to close this top. Okay, interesting. Oh look, so I actually have to like look at it. It's interesting. Health okay, abilities low, low, low. <laughs> Discover the plague cure. Okay, we have no notes. How do we put it away? Tab? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Interesting. This game isn't running as well as I hoped it would. It's running a bit dodgy. I don't know why. But that's okay. Let's keep running through the woods. Okay. There's a note on the table in the shed. Take it with the left move button. Oh god, it's full of blood. Okay. Let's all read this. From Professor Douglas to Dr. Sanchez. My tests have been successful. We have a cure. <gasps> Begin immediate synthesis of, oh god, Dracodracine by combining the following agents. Agent X, primary antibiotic. Agent Y, antitoxin. Agent Z, adjuvant. A single injection will safely eliminate all trace of plague growth within 4 to 12 hours. Okay. Interesting stuff. So we must find that cure. So are we following the blood? This blood looks so funky. Like, what the hell? Is that supposed to be blood? Oh, God, yeah. Okay, yes, it is supposed to be blood. So... I'll be undead then. Why am I, hand Why am I holding my hands so weird? I'm like a robot. <laughs> anyway, let's go out of this cabin. Oh, God. God, what is going on? Why is there so much stuttering? Press, this is a laboratory, press H to learn more. Right, I'll be back in one second, I'm just going to stop the recording for one second and see if I can sort of fix my graphics a little. It doesn't seem to be running that much better, but we'll see. 
Let's see how it goes. Okay. This is a storage button press what? I thought it said M, but that's my map button, is it? So your map encompassed in hand, you can determine your location using triangulation. To do this, click on two known landmarks. A landmark can be a statue or structure somewhere in the land. It's considered known if it is already represented on your map. Your crosshair will turn into a triangle if the landmark you are looking at is known. Additionally, your location will automatically be revealed whenever you are standing next to a known landmark. Okay, interesting. I have nothing <laughs> so far, so good start. Uh, is there so no way to open drawers or anything? Oh, samples of blood. Lovely. What is this? Okay. How to research a plant or fungus? This island is full of unique plant and fungal species. Many of these have have curative properties that can be discovered through research in a laboratory. Place a single plant or fungus on the blue examination tray. Initiate research on the specimen by using the microscope. Okay, so I don't think I, I don't have anything yet, so I can't really do anything. So, okay. It's age to learn more. Synthesis station, synthesis station allows you to create medicines and tonics from the specimens you discover on the island. To use the synthesis station, place a specimen on at least one tray. Synthesis will materialize on the yield tray. You'll find other medicines that can be created by a single specimen, while others need two. Okay, interesting. Someone's, you're being watched. Oh god, that does not sound good. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Can we collect this shit? Take plants and fungal by pressing. Yay, flowers! I discovered a white pink viola. Typical example of the viola genus. This flower is white and pink in colour. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> Why am I just keeping this in my hand? Do -do 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 -do. Just walking about with this plant. Hello, little birdie. Oh no. Find fresh water to drink. Since you are stricken with plague, you will become dehydrated very quickly. There are fresh water lakes and ponds all over the island. Press LMB when you're looking down. This will also fill up your canteen for future use. You'll notice that the sea around the island is salt water, which you cannot drink. Yep, that makes sense. Okay, so is that. No, this looks like a lake, doesn't it? So. Yes. Yeah, Looks like a lake to me. So, okay. I need to get. Oh, you're drowning. Press H to learn more. What? Give me that flower. Oh, for goodness sake. Right, get out of the water, you useless dick. Right. What is it saying now? It's saying that I can't drink this? Oh god. Why can I not drink it? Maybe it comes to seawater, I really don't know. Now let's get over here. No, right, okay. Maybe this is what it meant. Maybe it meant this little bit. Yeah, there we go. Yummy. So is this, how do I tell if this is filling my canteen? Maybe I don't have one yet? Yeah, maybe I don't have a canteen yet. What's that? Oh, another little bird. Another lovely stretch of water. This game does look quite nice. It does. Um, that's the red shack we've been to, so we'll head over this way. Why is my guy... Oh, I guess because I've got a plague right now, but... <laughs> it's probably to remind me. Uh, game runs a little weird, um, sadly. It's kind of... Dampening my experience a little. Oh, nice! Who wants to go, eh? Who wants to be that shit? Eh? You can't. So, I take it I haven't got an inventory or anything. Right, let me, I want to discover this little thing. Can I discover you? Oh, he doesn't give two shits. Oh, I can check my watch as well. Okay. So, it's like I can only carry one thing at a time, which kind of sucks. <laughs> Oh god. 
Save your game by lighting candles or lanterns. There we go. Okay, we have a map. Awesome. Okay, statue. Ah, right, okay. So we know where the lab is, so we know... Yeah, we can get to that. Which is cool. Use beds to recuperate strength and save your game. Me as well. I think we've been going, what, 10 minutes? I'm going to sleep with this torch in my hand. <laughs> Oh no, the torch went out! Shit. Can't I like steal the lantern? Oh! <laughs> Pouring some. Oh, and filling my canteen, nice. Why didn't he do that in the lake? I don't know why he didn't do that in the lake. Oh, food. No, I don't want to punch somebody, I want to fucking eat it. What is the eat button? No, I'm throwing the banana! Oh, screw it. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Why am I throwing the banana? Oh, yeah, I'm really getting disappointed by this frame rate. It's really not cool. Because um, this game seems really interesting to me. Okay, interesting looking statue up there. Head of you is a cartography table. Press H to learn more. Cartography tables, triangle, location, and that. Ah, here it is. Okay, a guide to cartography. Triangulation. Oh my word. Okay. Landmark. Vantage point one, vantage point two. Triangle. Okay. How to reveal the locations of unknown landmarks. Uh, step 1. Use triangulation to pinpoint your location on the map as described in mapping document A. Look around you. Try to cite landmarks that are not currently represented as icons on your map. Unknown landmarks. Step 3. Draw sight lines to these unknown landmarks by pressing activate as you observe them. What is the activate button? Who knows. Uh, store your map and compass and walk to the vantage point. Now repeat steps 1 to 3. When you have drawn two distinct sight lines to a given unknown landmark, its location will be revealed by the intersection of the two sight lines and therefore will become known. Wow, okay, this game is interesting. Right, I don't care that you discovered that. Okay, it's telling me how to triangulate something, but I don't know if I entirely understood what he was talking about. Oh wait, is this, is this me using it? Okay, how do I... Oh, no, I don't want to do that. How do I use this thing? How do I get back to the zoom? Ah, why does it zoom in at the start and then piss off? I want to look at it. Oh, for fu oh well, fuck you, map. You dickhead. I ain't triangulating shit, I'm just going to this fucking statue. Okay, I don't think we should try to swim across there, that's not the best idea, probably. Oh god! Fucking seagull! Control's a little slippery as well. Um, that's why you see me like slipping down that hill there. It's a bit weird. Oh, a little rickety bridge. Yay! Okay. That's nothing. Okay, so where was that landmark? It's over this way. Oh, more water. I think we can get to it though. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go this way. See if we can get up. What is this? Oh, shells, I think. Can we get up here? Oh, there's another one. Hello. Oh, look, now I'm aiming at the fucking thing. So. Right, 
hold on to check what the action, what the action button was. Or, or what was the button? It says activate le oh, left move button. Okay. I don't know if that did anything. Ah, ah. I'm guessing, is there no reason for me to actually go up here? Are these just for landmark purposes? They probably are, aren't they? Can I pick that little guy up? I guess they must just be for landmark purposes so you can know your way about, I guess. But hey. Oh god, careful, careful! Ow, 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 oh god. Oh god, that was too realistic. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh god, that was awesome. <laughs> that was cool, I liked that. Okay. Can I get water from here? Well, apparently not, apparently it's seawater, so. God, I wonder if that, like, damaged us in any way. I feel like I'm kind of getting lost here. So where the fuck am I? Oh wait. Huh. Let's try to triangulate that thing. Can't triangulate that. Okay. Oh, would you stop running like a maniac? Come on. I'm probably totally gonna die out here. I have no idea where the hell I am. Okay. Okay. It probably actually what the game probably actually wants us to experiment with flowers and stuff. So I should probably go back there and, and do that. So I kind of know where I am. We're at the shacks. And we're heading our way back. No need to get carried away and do a shitload of exploring just yet. That frame rate, come on! Oh wait, we haven't been here. I don't think. I think that's why I got that music cue. Yeah, we haven't been here. What is this? Pair of island photographs. A caption on the back of the photo reads, Pendergraph directing the construction of out output Sirius, or Sirius. A caption on the back of the photo, Professor Douglas instructing Dr. Sanchez. <laughs> nice pose. <laughs> okay. The music's got all nice. Okay, let's see what this is. It's another map. Map of Swamp Trail. So I'm here. And this is towards a camp apparently. Okay, interesting. Mate, yeah. How long was I recording before I stopped the first time? Was it only five minutes? Oh god, I can't remember. Don't want this video being too long. But this game really interests me, it does. The only bad thing I can say about it is the frame rate is. I mean, it's kind of fine just now, but see when like you hit certain points, the, the frame rate goes way down, and it doesn't feel good. It kind of takes you out of the experience a little. But this is this is pretty beautiful. I don't know. I, I find this just nice to play. Um, I don't know. I like it, but I think for now we'll we'll go to sleep and we don't have a. Oh, wait, what? How did I like that? I don't have anything to light it with. Oh, we may as well take water as well, actually. And then we'll go to sleep to save it to make sure our water's full or whatever. Yeah, so I don't know how how we actually drink our canteen. Like, when we go low. But I think we'll figure that out next time, I guess. Um, yeah, this game really interests me. I really think it's... I don't know, there's something nice just going about this world. Um, oh my god, it's night time. Oh god, okay, it's not nice anymore. Oh, this is... F oh, this is creepy now. Oh my god, it is dark. Can we light that candle? We can. 
Oh, ho, 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 ho. okay, that next episode is gonna be very fucking interesting, guys. Wow, that looks scary out there. <laughs> that looks really scary out there. Um, yeah, I, I really hope you you're looking forward to the next part of this um, because I really am. Um, like I say, once again, the frame rate is kind of a bit of an issue. I'll, I'll try to balance it and see what I can what I can do uh, for next time. We'll see if we can figure something out. Um, but yeah, some very, very interesting stuff going on and just kind of loving it for uh, for what it's worth. Um, yeah, so like the video if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Comment if you'd like to see more. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.